What's up everybody, Brick Sanchez here and I'm here today with a little small review of this uh, small Lego Paradisa set. This is a Lego uh, system set when it was still called system. Uh, it's from a team called Lego Paradisa which is very cool. Uh, me and my brother really liked it because it uh, kind of reminds us of the Vice City, Miami Beach type of um, coloring and all of that stuff. So it's very cool. My brother was a big fan of Vice City. So I'll quickly open up this little book here. As you can see, this is a fold-out manual. It has been perforated, as you can see. So it's just like this. Here is the Paradisa, like kind of corner that they had on the boxes and stuff. So, oh no, this is the corner they had on the boxes. So pretty cool, it's perforated though. So yeah, it's a very small set. I'll quickly go through this. Um, as you can see, it's called the Seaside Cabana. So very cool, it features this little uh, boat here, probably it's intended to look like an inflatable boat or something using these Technic bricks. It's pretty cool. Uh, it has another surfboard out here as well. Very awesome. I really like the sail on it. Or, yeah, I think it's it's called a sail, yeah. And uh, for the, as far as the minifigures go, we got two of those. We got First of all, we got this lady here um, wearing a bikini, what I believe, a bikini pants. And then a type of top. But as you can see... All of the rest is, <laughs> she's completely naked for the rest, even the sides here, <laughs> because yeah, um, I don't even know if they make side prints nowadays, but I don't think so, but these are very cool. I always try to collect the yellow torsos and all of that stuff um, when we were children, because then we could make um, like people who are swimming and stuff, people who are yeah being naked, <laughs> actually. So now for the second figure out here, we got this dude with a very awesome mustache. <laughs> so very cool looking, I'm gonna take off his head because uh, he has a very cool, as you can see, very cool tank top type of thing out here. He has this kind of French, he's giving me this kind of French vibe, so with uh, the stripes out here, but it's very cool with this deep um, V-neck type of thing, even though it's not a V. But uh, so very cool, we got two of these, uh, two figures, and uh, I think these would go in any beach setting, they, will, they would look very good. As you guys maybe know already, I have a kind of Paradisa area on my beach. So that is, that is where this will be going. I will try to show you this later in the video as well. So we got the little boat, we got this little um, surfboard out here. And then we got this cool small little cabana type of thing. And uh, Quite a few Paradisa sets have, have had some similar um, infrastructure in them. So we got the arches with the uh, bright pink I believe. Um, fences out here and then the bright pink uh, seats and then we got some plant pieces on top just to give it that kind of like I don't know uh, vacation feel so very nice I think this was also part of the leisure team I'm not sure if this was part of it but you also have a s kind of leisure team so for people who go on surfing vacations all of that stuff so very cool then we got this awesome printed piece out here this is a um, with the light green and the bright pink. I'm still not sure if it's bright pink. So very cool. Um, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> it's just a small set. So I'm going to place it in the city now, right along, uh, right alongside the other Paradisa sets. And uh, I'm going to show you that in an instant. Okay, so as you can see, we got the Paradisa area out here. Um, you can recognize it by these base plates in light green. Uh, I've also added these. Oh, I just broke this off. Alright, as you can see, these 8x16 Paradisa light green base plates that we just got in the recent Bricklink haul. Um, and I've placed the Seaside Cabana right there. So it's right in the curvature of this roller coaster as well, next to the, uh, the Paradisa Ice Cafe or the, just a regular cafe. But yeah, now for the rest, as you can see, I've put the surfer out there in the water next to the, the other surfboard which came with that cafe. And then we got the little boat out here, so yeah, I'll be going through all of these changes and all of these other stuff in uh, my next uh, LEGO City update, so. Alright, something else I forgot to mention, this uh, this Seaside Cabana set came out in 1992, so uh, that's almost 30 years ago already, can you believe that? It's been a very long time. Uh, I was born in 1995, so uh, it was three years before I was even born, but uh, yeah, very awesome. Alright guys, that was it for this little small review. Uh, like, subscribe, check out my Instagram page and I'll see you on the next review, Bricklink Hall or City Update.